Hey guys, I am back with another haul. Uh, this is going to be extremely small. Um, so yeah, this is in regards to part three because uh, one is for traveling purposes. Even though I'm going end of June, which is like next month, which is the beginning of May. It's literally like May 1st today. But since I was there, I decided to get it. And then the other one was partially because of travel, but then also want to try it out um, at home, which I've never done before. And yes, I am going to put the link for the Amazon below, just in case they have a whole bunch of different brands. Um, now I'm going to start with the Amazon one first, just in case. Um, I actually thought it was going to be a little bit bigger. I don't know why. This is the lash lift, you know. Um, I think it's more popular specifically on tiktok i would say where people are actually trying at home i wouldn't say popular but like since you know prices of things are going up i, I feel like the eyelash extensions are more popular right now like the conversation behind it but i came across lash lift videos too where people were trying it at home so i don't know why i thought the box will be bigger god knows why but here we are i'm gonna open it just in case just to show you guys honestly um and then i will try my best to make a video out of it i guess this is more information related stuff on these little cards there's like three of them then i believe this goes on top of the eyes oh well i mean under the eyes um but yeah which obviously i'm gonna read through it while working on it this is then we got this little tool right here um this one right here has the brushes and you know the pads and everything are in here um i do want to shorten this video in particular you know even though if i like you know do the video in another one that wants to it Okay, so these are the pads. Even like the pads, I feel like are a tad bit small, but here we are. We got this little, what is this one? Uh, the V brushes are in here. Then we got the um, the mascara ones, the micro brushes, and the applicators in this little thing right here. So, and then we have like the adhesives, um, cleanser, lifting, setting condition all in here. So that's how this one in particular looks like. I feel like I kind of want to <laughs> put this back while we are making a video. Um, I don't know if I want to do that now because here we are. So I feel like let me just take this out. Makes sense. Well, actually, I don't want to take it out. Like, I don't know. But here we are. So let's put these in it's just that i want to post the box that's what it is i, I want to post this lovely box you know and now it won't go in clearly like okay. there we go we got that done i will definitely try to do like close up with my eyelashes before and after and the whole nine yards um while trying to make a video i don't know how great it would be but we are going to try to do that lovely video Wait, hold on. why do i look like a hot mess now trying to put all this stuff back so there we go and clearly things do want to start coming out now why i don't know do I want to try this today? I don't know. Let's see how things go about. There we go. Now I put this away. This is going to be to be quick. This is a uh, Faragamo perfume. They are actually a purse company, but like you know, um, a lot of these higher end brand purses do have perfume collections as well. Um, today I was out and about with my family, and my mom actually didn't want to get a purse. She hadn't given, gotten a purse in a while. And normally, since she doesn't really go shopping, like, let me rephrase that. She used to go crazy with purse shopping before. 
but then for a while now she kind of stopped and I was like oh let me use um the ones that I have you know so she mainly I think she had she has let me rephrase that two Louis Vuitton bags and then a couple of Michael Corp purses well let me say purses not bags right then um she put a pause I think she said that she has not re. Really I think she has bought purses more of like the wallets and stuff re more recently, but she really had been carrying those purses like you know been rotating them, and be using them like crazy, so she wanted a new purse now, because I think she definitely said that she had not bought a purse or uh, like I think the last time she bought the purse was like prior to COVID, so it definitely has been five six years like an actual one that where she'd be using on a regular. So she did go into a couple of stores like Gucci, Coach, Louis Vuitton. Eventually, she came. To, she remembered this brand, Paragamo, and she ended up liking a purse from. Well, not a purse, but she got like a little one. Well, yeah, it is a purse, like a little one. But she was saying that she's gonna use it when she goes to the weddings and stuff. Um, but whatever. But I actually tried all their perfumes while I was there, like the testers, and I actually liked every single one of them. So the person that was helping me actually did mention that she, this is one of the best sellers, apparently. So I was like, I'm gonna try it. Well, I did try it. So I was like, okay, I'll buy this one because honestly, it retails like 115 or 125, I believe. So I was like, I don't mind purchasing all of them, honestly, but I'm gonna buy one for now. So this is how it looks, especially if you're somebody who's like really, really girly and stuff. I believe this perfume will definitely be really something that you like. It is like, um, this is the first time I've actually seen like somebody come out like this, like this kind of design at the top, honestly. So yeah, um, I definitely do recommend every single one of their perfumes, honestly, because I do like it. This one particularly is the Ferragamo Sign... Signorina, I think that, or Signorina, and it's the, I think the scent itself is called the Unica, I believe, but it is an Italian brand from my understanding. Um, so yeah, other than that, if you guys do want me to look any, into any other products, please let me know in the comment section below. Other than that, I'll be linking both my Instagram pages, make sure to follow, hit the subscribe button, the bell button, and I'll be back for more. Stay safe and stay tuned, guys.